And it is the EFF members, in fact, it is the Secretary General of the party, Marshal Zlamini. You see them almost uh, fending off, I think would be the word to use, fending off a group of people who had gone to the party's premises. Remember, in the coming hour, the EFF leader, Julius Malema, is expected to address a media briefing, and that briefing was going to be the culmination of the activities that you saw uh, ending what has been a build-up to the 10th anniversary of the EFF's 10-year anniversary. And Junia Kumalo is watching the space for us there. Junior, good morning to you. Just tell us what happened. Who are the two groups that are clashing there? Good afternoon, Oli. Um, indeed, we are at the EFF headquarters here at Gandhi Square, where a group of uh, about 10 to 15 white people came to the EFF headquarters and said they wanted to be part of the briefing that is going to take place today. Uh, as soon as they got to the door, uh, they were confronted by the EFF leadership. We saw the EFF Secretary General, Marshal Zamini, and the EFF's Head of Presidency, Vuyani Pambo, engaging those gentlemen. And uh, it escalated very quickly to a point where uh, fists were being thrown, uh, they were slapping the, the individuals that had gathered outside, and uh, now those 15, about 15 people that had come to the EFF headquarters have since left the EFF leadership right now is walking back into the EFF building where the press conference is expected to start at 12 o'clock. Uh, Was there provocation, Junior? I think that's the word. Was there provocation from this group uh, which resulted in the fists being thrown? Uh, as far as we saw, there was no provocation. They had just merely asked to be a part of the uh, press briefing that is going to take place. So they came in, they were standing outside, and they asked to be part of the press briefing because they said they had questions that they wanted to ask to the EFF leader. But as soon as they gathered outside, they were confronted by the EFF leadership as well as the EFF security, and they were asked to leave. Um, it was not just asking. Um, we saw a few fists flying from the secretary. We saw even the head of presidency, Vuyani, slapping one of the gentlemen there. And um, they even left without any um, response. Like, they didn't fight back. They immediately started walking away as they saw that they were not welcome in this area right now. Uh, Junior, I see on your screen as you talk to us the EFF leadership and you're saying... Vuyane Pambo, that's the person in picture right now. And try and see if we can speak to them right now, but I'm not sure if they're willing to speak to us. Okay. Uh, the EFF head of presidency. When the president speaks. So I think this president will address us. Okay, let's leave it at that. That's, that's the EFF head of presidency, uh, Vuyani Pambo, saying that the EFF leader, Julius Malema, will address what happened right now when he does deliver that press briefing call. All right, uh, Junior Kumalo, thank you very much for putting us uh, in the picture there. And uh, what a, a start, or should we say a precursor to the start of this media briefing. And I suspect it is going to be quite a, a fiery one. Uh, thank you very much. That media briefing expected to kick off at the top of uh, 12 o'clock. Complete, complete uh, surprise, I suppose, I, I could tell you, because... Uh, I don't know if the EFF leadership anticipated uh, such a grouping coming through and perhaps that is what they will uh, say provoked the whole situation that the people came and wanted to be part of the media briefing as Junior explains it. But uh, uh, we are going to have to hear from the leader of the EFF whether uh, the violence was necessary.